Alright, so this video is going to be about the depression and the regression away from, you know, oneself during this quarantine, little, you know, pandemic or whatever. So first off, I want to say, you know, everything, perception is reality, you know what I'm saying? And shout out to Von Tu Cut, that man Von Tu Cut, for um, basically helping me, inspiring me to help kind of make this video to get this message out. Because, um, you know, I've been... I've been peeping his videos a lot. He got a lot of gang space, so you know what I'm saying? This is to capitalize off of not necessarily stuff that he's been saying, but to kind of get my own perspective on what, you know, this whole quarantine thing got everybody feeling like and how to overcome those feelings that you may be feeling if you, you know, have fallen into that quote-unquote sunken place. So, you know, first of all, let me just say this, right? Like everything, like I said earlier, perception is reality. Your mindset is your reality. One thing I noticed today when I woke up is I was feeling like mad bored, mad depressed. But then like I switched my mindset over. I simply with just one thought I was able to switch my mindset over and be like, you know what? Ain't nobody else going to get this done for me. Ain't nobody else going to get on this grind for me but me. So, you know, I just had to make sure I was like, I right, let me switch my mindset over. Let me get up out of bed. Let me get up, you know what I'm saying? Get my day started. Let me start on a positive note. So that way I can, you know, do better by myself because ain't nobody going to do for me but what I can do for myself. And I'm definitely not going to be able to grow as a person if I just sit in bed all day. That's something that we all know. But it's like, you know, some people, they fall into that sunken place where it's like, you know, I, even though, you know, you want to get up, you want to feel like feel like you could change the world and everything. And when you want to feel like, you know, everything isn't as difficult as it really is when you got the weight of the world on your shoulders, what it feels like. But I mean, I just feel like, like I said, all that is just the, all that's just a perception. Like, you know, you could as easily as you could fall into that place, you could pull yourself right, right out with just a single thought. So, you know, that's all it really is to it for, for like, it ain't really much to it. Just, you know, switch your mindset over. If you're feeling depressed, if you're feeling like 2020 was one of the worst years ever, then shit, switch your mindset over. Ask yourself, how can I get from point A to point B all the way to point Z? And, you know, move on from there. Because honestly, like, you know, I'll say this, like, working out, that's a good way to, you know, switch your mindset over. It's a good way to build self-esteem. Let's see, eating proper foods, that's a good way to build up your self-esteem so you don't always feel so sluggish and tired from eating all the BS. You know what I'm saying? So just little things, you know what I'm saying? Just being conscious about the little things that you do throughout your day can help you get a better understanding of who you are what makes you feel a certain type of way and what makes you feel and, you know, give you a reason as to why you may be feeling as depressed as you are in this current point in time. I don't feel like everybody's feel, feel that way. I just feel like, you know, for the ones who are still kind of struggling, who felt like 2020 may have been one of the worst years ever, it's not the end of the world. If anything, we coming into a time and place now where the energy is changing and if you tap into that, you can really like, you know, meditation, you can really tap into that energy through meditation just to be able to say like, you know, OK, well, let me get on my grind and let me, you know, do right by myself because ain't nobody else going to do right by myself but me. So, you know, I, I feel like that kind of mindset helps with a lot. Like it helps deal with a lot of problems, like emotional problems. Like I said, I was just feeling depressed this morning. You know what I'm saying? Like, a nigga ain't had a job since, like, October and shit. You know what I'm saying? I've been trying to work, you know, trying to find little side hustles to try and make this money so I could keep, you know, keep keep my phone on just to, you know, do the basic stuff. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, a nigga kind of down bad, but I always stay up to something, though. So, you know, just remember that, you know, even though if you down bad, always stay up to something to get yourself back up. Because once you down, there's only one way to go. So, you know, um, I feel like at the end of the day, you know, like I said, your perception is your reality. If you're the type of person that always keeps a negative mindset, then you always gonna reap negative benefits or negative consequences. If you're the type of person to keep a positive mindset, then you always gonna reap the positive consequences. So you know what I'm saying? Just you know, just keep an open mind, you know what I'm saying? Just be more mindful about your emotions, your thoughts, and you know, where they come from. I think that helps a lot too. You know, when I was asking myself, you know, why am I so depressed this morning? It's because I'm not working right now. Let's be, let's keep it a whole buck. I ain't really working right now. You know, I'm sitting in bed trying to find ways to make money, but it's like, you know, by doing that, I'm only prolonging myself from making the money. So, you know, action, action always speaks louder than words. So I just had to twit, like tweak my mindset to, 
get me up out of bed. I had to tweak it. I had to say, you know what? Let me get up out of bed. Let me go do for myself what nobody else is going to do for me. Let me put this work in so I can do this and, you know, say I did something today to better myself instead of just sitting in bed all day and, you know, prolonging my pl prolonging my time within the sunken place. So, you know what I'm saying? Like, everybody, you know what I'm saying? Stay on your grind. Stay blessed, you know what I'm saying? Keep a positive mindset because ain't nobody going to do for you what you can do for yourself. Stop relying on others. Stop pointing the fingers and everything. You know what I'm saying? If you in a bad place now, switch your mindset over and always tell yourself you in a good place because from that point on, all you can really do is go up. So, I mean, you know, everybody stay blessed. Everybody stay up. You know what I'm saying? Uh, remember, it's not the end of the world because this is your life to live. You only got... Some people believe you only got one. I don't believe I only got one to live. But within this lifetime, I'm going to make the best of it while I can. So, you know what I'm saying? Like, just, like I said, be blessed. Big ups. Uh, big ups to brother Von Two Cut because, you know, he's been helping a lot of people out. You know, shout out to him. Um, shout out to all the other uh, spiritual YouTubers. Shout out to all the big name YouTubers that be spitting that game and talking. They, you know what I'm saying? And helping other people out of their funks and everything. And, you know, keeping them going as well. Um, and everybody just stay blessed. You know, we out here.